guys, it's Vampire Mike from Sega CD Universe, and uh, I want to do a quick unboxing. I never ever order special editions of video games. Uh, I usually don't like the stuff they come with. The last one I ordered was Destiny on the Xbox One as well. It was the middle version that came with like the, all the extra passes and add-ons and stuff. So the only reason I did that is because I knew I wanted to get the passes anyway, and it kind of worked out better. In hindsight, I sort of wish I got the better edition because I did... I do love Destiny, that little cool ghost cube thing would have been cool to have, but not a big deal. So anyhow, and the one before that I ordered I think was Fallout 3. I don't think I've had a, a special edition of anything since. So here we have this gigantic ass box for the Elder Scrolls Online Tamriel Unlimited Imperial Edition, because you know that name can't get long enough, it's like a Spanish person's name. So. Let's uh, cut this bad boy open here. I'm gonna check the back out. Looks like a helmet. Some screenshots. Uh, it says it comes with uh, play as an Imperial, a white Imperial horse, a mud crab vanity pet, and rings of Mara, or Mara. Uh, what rings of Mara are, how to look this up, is it lets you marry someone in the game, anyone you want, like a friend or whatever and you then can get bonus XP anytime you quest with them. So my luck, the person I play the most with is my good friend Brian. So in Elder Scrolls I'm gonna have to marry one of my best friends. So that'll be fun. Let's see here. Uh, I never do unboxings. I don't think I've ever done an unboxing on this channel. I rarely do pickups. But this is, this was I think a hundred bucks and I had a ton of credit um, from GameStop. If I can only figure out how to open it, here we go. I had a ton of credit from GameStop, I still do. I think I have like four more games paid off. So, wow. Okay. All right, let's try this first. So I guess this is the Imperial Edition, like steel box kind of jammy, just like the uh, Destiny one. Got my, uh, code to put in on the back, which I obviously can't show you, to get the Imperial, Mud Crab, Rings of Mara, and the White Horse. God, let's see what else here we got. A map of uh, Tamriel. I don't know if I'm going to open this whole thing, but you get the point. Pretty cool. Uh, I haven't played an Elder Scrolls game since Oblivion. I didn't play Morrowind and I didn't play Skyrim. I heard Skyrim was very good. Uh, a little ad to uh, pay every month to get more crowns, otherwise the game is free online. And this is, I think, just a little a little manual with, uh, you know, the, the, button, the buttons on the uh, system, what, what does what. So, and then here is the other view. Oh. Oh, there's more stuff at the bottom. This is kind of cool. This is cooler than I thought. What the fuck? I'm gonna have to cut this. All right, so anyhow, we'll open this first then. Caution. Wow, I think that's real leather. Um, huh, it's a uh, kind of like a, oh, let's get in, the, in view there, huh? Kind of like a art book with tons of information, drawings. Let's see if I can hold it up a little better without like dropping it or ripping it. Pretty cool stuff. Um, I, didn't, I don't think I realized this came with it. So this is kind of interesting. Really, really big and, you know, bound nicely. It's pretty interesting looking. Uh, sorry this took a couple more days longer than when the game got released because I ordered it from GameStop, like I said, and I didn't get it until today. Oh. 
my niece says. Oh, nice. She's one and a half. Uh, I might have to cut this. This is annoying. Oh, I can cut this. They really tied this bitch in there. I don't really want to stop the camera. There we go. I think I got it. Ta-da. Alright. Almost, guys, I swear. Alright, so we got this bad motherfucker. I forget his name. I think he's one of the bad guys from, uh, from this. Or maybe he's the main bad guy. I'm not even sure. I have no idea what the story is. So he's got this fucking crazy tail. Plugs into his back. His ass. Kind of like an alien tail. And... See if I can figure this out in one try. I would assume that this one goes up. Yep. Pretty cool. Um, it's like plasticky. I, I didn't think it was metal actually. I, I wasn't sure. It looked kind of metal the way it was like stained or whatever, but it's uh, it's plastic. Um, it's made nice though. It feels you know fairly solid. A lot of nice detail in like the face and the back and shit. He's holding some dude in his hand. And he's probably gonna like eat. Pretty cool. Um, is it worth a hundred bucks? This thing probably not. <laughs> But uh, if you're a big Elder Scrolls fan, which, I mean, I do like the series, I don't, like, love it, um, then I would say probably yes. I really did it because, as I said, I had a ton of credit, and I really just wanted to get the extra stuff. Um, I didn't know what groups or factions my friends were going to pick. This gives you the opportunity when you pre-order it, I think, to join any faction you want, uh, so you don't have to uh, fight against your friends or whatever. And uh, that's really it, so... Thanks guys for watching, it's Vampire Mike from Sega CD Universe, be good.